Hello, my dear Aquarius. Aquarius, welcome to Practical Mystic. Today, we'll know what's the message for you from the Divine for this month of March. As I'm going to be using the powerful thought cards and the beginner tarot deck. And by the way, this is a general reading. This is not a one to one reading. So just take in what is that specific message that resonates with you using your intuition. Well, I'm reading this generally using my intuition also. So let's get started. I'm gonna set aside this first and use the beginner tarot deck. Universe, spirits, angels, my sisters. What does my dear Aquarius need to know for this month of March? Tell me, please. Alright. Next is the Powerful Thought Cards by Louise Hay. Universe, spirits, angels, my sisters. Okay, so let us know the message for you. The first card is ta -da! This is the um, six of two for uh, six of pentacles. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. So we have here. You are. You are charitable. You are benevolent. This is Taurus energy, actually, and this is showing me that you, your heart chakra is active. So y you are giving gifts because you are generous you give charity or donations or money to the community you extend assistance or support or employment to others you share your kindness your wealth um, you share your prosperity and power your your you have that authority or and control by assisting others helping others and you you share your uh, the return of your investments to others and with that uh, six of pentacles is the you're at peace you with your age each age has its own special special joys and experiences you're always the perfect you uh, you're always the perfect age for where you are in life yes you are peaceful with your age and the next yes we have um, this is actually the six of swords this is Aquarius energy oh what's but not so sure that in in the sense that 
your your heart chakra is still act still active as confirmation to this six of pentacles with this you cannot move forward because of trouble that that has come your way you're out of frying pan into fire um the six of swords uh indicates that there is um lack of progress in whatever you do or in in the in the things that you do maybe because um there are still other people that you need to to pay attention just like uh your parents need you in need of your love maybe you are busy in giving to others um extending your help assistance but if you're helping others there are also people that that are actually in need of having a felt need of your of your love and it's your parents so be aware have this consider your parents as tiny children who needs your love my dear Aquarius and it says here you have compassion for your parents childhoods you now know that you chose them because they are perfect for what you had to learn you forgive them and set them free and by doing that you are also setting yourself free so the next card for you is this the moon in reverse so it could mean that you have to activate your third eye chakra you need to release fears you are beginning to unveil your secrets or there's subsiding anxiety or trust and regaining composure or self-deception so it could be that um you lack progress because there is something that is unveiled that you need to unveil unveil it like unveil the secrets or you lack progress because of fear that you have so this fear should be terminated you need to release that fear and regain composure or get rid yourself from self-deception and with that the moon in reverse just uh, do not be afraid Re it's time to release your fears you know as i say yes as you say yes to life then life will say yes to you again 
just say yes to life and life will say yes to you life mirrors your every thought as you keep your thoughts positive life brings to you only good experiences yeah so think positive in order to attract a positive life and the next card for you is this one the ten of pentacles two four six eight ten yeah ten ten of pentacles because you know your root chakra is abundant so you deserve this ten of pentacles since the uh, the wealth is is located in in the root chakra and because your root chakra is active you are having this ten of pentacles which is the culmination of financial abundance you know you might be receiving unexpected windfall of abundance a lump sum uh, a will or deeds you might also this could be your trust fund or inheritance such as or could be a solid foundation a privilege or inherited sources from your ancestry so uh, you are having this ten of pentacles and with the ten of pentacles you enjoy yourself loving yourself you love your your body just like how you love this flower you give you nourish this enough with enough sunlight and water so are so you are glowing like this like this flower you create peacefulness in your mind and your body reflects the peacefulness as perfect health yeah so i love it for you and the next card for you is this the five of wands the five of wands in reverse is a leo energy and this indicates that you might be compromising something or you might be ending a conflict or you might experience an end of conflict a row or struggle and reaching agreements yeah so um you might receive an end of conflict or struggle maybe because you are going to know unleash the secrets or knowing the truth and with the five of wands is that life supports you life is supporting you life created me to be fulfilled i trust life i mean sorry life created you to be fulfilled you trust life and life is always there at every turn you are safe so do not be afraid life is 
supporting you. As long as you say yes to life, then life will say yes to you in return. As long as <clears throat> you think positive towards life. So continue to love, love your body, love yourself, love your parents, and be at peace with your age. Then you will be deserving to have this ten of pentacles for you so this is what i have for you my dear see you in the next reading and get blessed